In this lesson, we will learn how to plot straight lines, regions, and relations. On your handheld or your computer software, open up a new graphs application. We are going to plot the straight line y equals 2x plus 4. So we simply type in 2x add 4. And you get your straight line. Press tab and it will take you into a second entry line for a new equation. We're going to press the backspace key or the delete key on your keyboard. So press delete. Come down to option 6 which is relation this time. And we're going to enter the relation 2x plus 5y equals 8. A new straight line is drawn, but we entered it in relation form this time. If you wanted to find the intersection point of those two lines, we would press the menu key. We would come down to option 6, which is analyze graph. And we're then going to choose option 4, intersection. Lower bound means you click just on the left of your intersection point. Upper bound, click just on the right. And you will get the coordinates of that intersection point. Let's insert a new page. And to do that, we will go Control and then Add Page, which is above the dot key. We're going to come down and add in a new graphs application. We are going to graph a horizontal line and we're going to graph y equals 4 or f2x equals 4. Press enter and you've got your horizontal line. We're going to graph a vertical line now. Press tab and it takes you back into the function entry box. Press the delete or your backspace key on your keyboard. Come down to relation again. And to enter your vertical line, let's type in x equals negative 5. Press enter. And you've got your vertical line passing through x equals negative 5. We will now graph some regions. So we're going to open up a new graphs application. So control and then doc, which is add a new page. We're going to insert a new graphs application. Now to graph a region, press your backspace key. You can choose options one through five, or you can choose relation. So we're going to just choose option two, y less than, and we're going to graph the region y less than x minus three. Press enter, and that region has been sketched for you. We're now going to enter a second region. So press the tab key and type in Y. Now we're going to go bigger than or equal to. You can type in bigger than with an equal sign or alternatively, press the control key on your keyboard and then the equals sign and you will get a little template. Choose the bigger than or equal to symbol and we're going to graph negative x add one. This time, you've got the region above the line y equals negative x plus one. Note that the combined region or the intersection of those two regions is the darker shaded area whereas the union of those regions would be all of the areas combined. Also note that when you have a bigger than or equal to symbol on our minus x plus one line, we have a solid boundary line to indicate the bigger than or equal to. And if we've got a strictly less than symbol, we have a dotted line on our boundary. Again, if we wanted to find the intersection point of those two lines, we could again go menu, come down to option six, which is analyze graph, and we're going to find the intersection. 
lower bound, click just on the left, upper bound, click just on the right, and you have the coordinates of the intersection point there also. That is all for this lesson. Be sure to check out the other lessons in this series.